ABC special presentation. everyone. I'm Jen London. And I'm Regis Philbin. Happy Easter. And we are your hosts for the 1996 Walt Disney World Happy Easter Parade, along with our good friends from Walt Disney World's Inside Out, J.D. Ross and Brian Leary. Hi, everybody. Happy Easter, you guys. Did you check out the smiles on all the faces of all these people who are coming into the Magic Kingdom for the parade? It's great. And I mean, they're arriving by the thousands, by train, by plane, <laughs> by bus, by boat. It's unbelievable. He's that's right. right. That's right, Reese. The more the merrier. See, it's my job to meet and greet as many yeah, people yeah, as yeah. I possibly right. can. Yeah, yeah, right, right, right. Well, well, J.D.'s mingling his brains out. I'm going to head over to the New Disney Institute. All, all right? right, now that we all know what our jobs are going to be, let's get started, all right? The parade is about to begin. He's right. Come on, let's get Direct from the Walt Disney World Resort in Orlando, Florida. All the magic, fun, and excitement of television's biggest Easter celebration. It's the Walt Disney World Happy Easter Parade. With your hosts, Joan London and Regis Philbin. And special guests on the Disney Channel's Walt Disney World Inside Out, J.D. Roth and Brian Leary. Brotherly Love's Andrew, Matthew, and Joey Lawrence. Mickey and Minnie, Mr. and Mrs. Easter Bunny, Beauty and the Beast, The Little Mermaid, Mary Poppins, and all of your favorite Disney friends. And it's all just a hop, skip, and a jump away in the happiest Easter parade ever. The 1996 Walt Disney World Happy Easter Parade is brought to you by 
to Simi St. Cloud, where you'll find affordability and value in the middle of Central Florida's best attraction. When you go on vacation, you want to be close to the action. When you stay in Kissimmee St. Cloud, the magic of Disney World is right at your doorstep. Next door is the excitement of Disney MGM Studios. You'll find new discoveries at Epcot. Just around the corner, you'll see the wonders of SeaWorld. Hold on, you're on an amazing adventure at Universal Studios. Stay in the center of it all at an affordable price. Kissimmee St. Cloud, the best vacation value. For your free close-up guide with discount coupons, call 1-800-711-KISS. Oh, the places Cool Whip can go. With less than two grams of fat per serving, take an everyday something and send it to magical new heights. Cool Whip. Oh, the possibilities. ABC Wednesday, Ellen's making her big movie debut. Go! With Carrie Fisher? Big fan, good, good look. Princess Leia! Ellen, then what's being taught in our schools? I would love to teach sex ed. Can I? Please, please, please? She's got the male part down. An all new faculty, ABC Wednesday. Happy Easter, everybody, and what a spectacular view of the most magical place in the whole world. Welcome back to the Walt Disney World Happy Easter Parade. And look what we found. It's a great day to be a bunny, huh, guys? Are Whoa, you kidding? He's getting a little this excited parade there. This is going to be hopping with bunnies. <laughs> all of your favorites are going to be here. The white rabbit, the Easter bunny, all except the March Hare, I'm afraid. Why not the March Hare? Because it's April. I, I had to ask. You know, I just had to ask. Well, anyway, besides our great parade and our little bevy of bunnies, there will be a lot more surprises coming our way, including a beach party blast with the Lawrence Brothers. Calm down, girls. Mm. <laughs> we'll also catch up with all of the wacky Toy Story stars over at the Disney MGM Studios. But first, let's check up on J.D. Roth. He's busy doing what comes naturally, working the crowd, making some new friends. Yo, J.D. All right, thanks a lot, Joan and Reese. Here we are. You guys excited to be here? We got all the people down on the street loving the Easter parade. In fact, I wonder, what's your name? Jennifer Evans. Jennifer Evans, where are you from? York, Pennsylvania. And do you have anyone to say hello to at home watching the parade? Yeah, my friend Emma and my, all my friends at school. Well, hello to everyone at school. It's very important that you guys watch the Easter parade with your family and have a good time. Are you guys having a good time? Yeah. <laughs> These people have come from all over the world. There's even someone over here. She's from Denmark. How do they say Happy Easter in Denmark? I'm not really sure what she said, but I hope it was Happy Easter. Back to you, Jonah Reed. Well, I know Danish, and she did say Happy Easter, Absolutely. of course. Thanks, J.D. All right, time now. We're going to turn our ears, our little ears here, and our eyes to the Walt Disney World Happy Easter Parade. Hey, that sounds good to us. Uh, you can always tell when it's Easter around here because everyone is dressed to the nines, including these 20 talented young dancers from Kissimmee, Florida's Raskin Dance School. I bet you they have a lot of fun dressing up like this. Look at them. You know, kids like to dress up, Joan. Yeah, us big kids do too sometimes. And here they come dancing down Main Street in their Sunday best. That Broadway melody they're performing is Sunday Clothes. You know, that was from the hit musical Hello, Dolly. Absolutely. These stunning costumes you see are from Disney Creative Costuming. Did you know they have the largest working wardrobe in the entire world? You know, and I thought Kathy Lee did. Uh-oh, I'm not touching that line. <laughs> hey, look what we've got now. 
Jeepers creepers, where'd they get that giant peeper? That is the biggest Easter basket anyone's ever seen. Took a very strong Easter bunny to deliver that one, right? Somebody who at least worked a year at the gym. We know this guy, there's Major Mike. Oh, I love Major Mike, leading the world band as usual. Never missed a step either. Major Mike, 15 melodious Easter parades, and it's a bond that can't be broken. Look at him, he loves it. Real tradition, isn't he great? Now here's a sure sign of Easter Sunday, hats, hats, and more hats. Yes, it's the very fashionable hat shop making its way down Main Street. Look at all those lovely ladies in their Easter bonnets. Don't you love it, Reach? I'm just brimming with excitement, if you know what I mean. No brimming. Brimming, brimming. Did <laughs> you say about brimming? That. the hat inside that tremendous hat box. I'll bet the Mad Hatter would love to get his hands on that one. And it's Sunday in the park with all of our friends and a perfect day for a drive. And Joan, check out who's driving Miss Daisy. <laughs> <laughs> and Donald Duck, of course, in an antique car from the days of old. Well, you kind of remember that model, right? It was Reece? my very first car. <laughs> all right, come and meet those dancing feet on Main Street. Now, that's the kind of traffic I like to see, Joan. Uh, nobody could accuse Goofy of sitting around on this veranda today. Look at him. Sid, no way. Our Goof's got way too much to do. Like celebrate Easter with his friends and neighbors. Happy Easter. And straight from Mary Poppins, School of Nanny Arts. Babies are their business. There are the little nannies. With all their little charges. There's Mr. Easter Bunny himself. Will you check him out now? And next to him, Mrs. Easter Bunny. I guess you could say they're today's royal couple. That's right. He's traveling down the bunny trail are also some mama bunnies and the teeniest, tiniest Easter Bunny. Oh, they're just adorable, aren't they? Our painter's getting ready to put a few finishing touches on. Mr. Easter Bunny and all those little aspiring bunny wannabes. It really was. Yeah, the fun is just beginning, so stay right where you are. We are going to celebrate Easter under the sea with the Little Mermaid when the Happy Easter Parade continues. We're the Piskin family from Long Island, New York. I'm Wayne, this is Megan. I'm Marlene. And I'm Kate. We're having a great time in Walt Disney World. Everybody have a happy Easter around America and around the world. Now you know why we call it pound cake. New Sara Lee Strawberry Swirl. Lots of real strawberries swirled into moist pound cake. A classic combination. Nobody doesn't like Sara Lee. Hey, sir, if you could just help me out. A new coat of paint, oh, so sweet. Sharp wedges, steel tanks, and great seat covers. Pretty please, you'll be the first place. softer side. Come see the softer side of Sears.
a toothpaste helps get teeth their dazzling whitest. People want to know more. But what's so different about Aquafresh whitening? A patented tri-clean formula that whitens without peroxide, bleach, or harsh abrasives. What does it really do? Aquafresh whitening safely and gently breaks up stains to help get your teeth their whitest. You got proof it works? Aquafresh whitening is clinically proven to whiten better than Crest. Even Rembrandt can't beat it. So every day I brush helps my teeth get whiter. Aquafresh whitening, safe to use every day for dazzling whiter teeth. Your eyes. Every day they open on a hostile world which can make them itchy and red. Now, from the eye care experts at Bausch & Lomb, comes doctor-prescribed medicine now available without a prescription. Opcon A Eye Drops. Opcon A goes beyond ordinary eye drops to relieve both redness and itching. It blocks your eye's reaction to pollen, ragweed, and animal hair. Calm and clear your eyes with Opcon A. From Bausch & Lomb, the relief your eyes have been looking for. A frisky cat is full of catitude, and you know where he's getting his frisky attitude. Friskies gives your cat 42 vital nutrients and the famous Friskies taste he loves. Mm, Friskies brings out the frisky in your cat. Last week, over 38 million people watched Home Improvement. Now see why everyone loves the tool man. You were a shop prodigy. Let's just say I was metallurgically well endowed. Home Improvement, followed by the all-new Pepsi Stuff Dana Carvey Show, ABC Tuesday. This is gonna be great. Here come people caught in jail. Hopping down the bunny trail. Here it happened, it's your side slide. Bringing every girl and boy. Baskets full of Easter joy. Things to make your Easter bright and gay. He's got jelly beans for Tommy. Oh, and it's for sisters too. There's a puppy for your mommy. And an Easter bunny too. Oh, here comes Peter Cotton and Tim. Disney Happy Easter Parade, and just how cute were those little kids, those little hats? I think they really got a kick out of being bunnies for a day. Yeah, but what I want to know is, will they eat their carrots? I don't know, I don't know, but hold on to your Easter bonnets. Everyone, there seems to be What's going on here? A, a change in the weather, I think. It's I getting windy. I don't get it, Joan. What, what could it be? It's Mary Poppins flying in for the parade. Ah, uh, Mary, welcome. A smooth landing. Thank you very much, Mary. Uh, they're terrific. But guess what? We are about to welcome another leading lady, and this one prefers a slightly different altitude. Yeah. 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 
dream about going She's our favorite little mermaid, and she's brought all of her friends from under the sea. Ah, look at that. I recognize one of the denizens of the deep. Could that be your little That little, little goldfish, Lindsay? I believe, was my Lindsay, yes. <laughs> I guess those swimming lessons really paid off. And she's there with Ariel, who's always happy to be part of our world once again. We got to be here naturally. Eric, come on, kiss the girl already, will you? We got the spirit, you got to hear it under the sea. Look at these guys on the stilts. And I just caught flounder. I, I mean, saw flounder. Sorry, yeah, he, that big guy. He may not like you to say that. Now I've waited all winter to say this, Joan. Play ball. All right, here come our youngest all-stars, are the Little Leaguers. Yeah, and check out Pluto there. Got to be our MVP. What's that? Most valuable pup. Somehow I just knew that. Uh -huh. staying with the major leaguers, forget about a Pluto. Oh, come on, Reed. No dream is too big here at Disney. At least that is one philosophy behind the Disney Institute. That's Disney's new vacation playground where you can go and do things that you've never done before. And things you've only dreamed of, like being a dancer or an artist. Remember when we went there, Joan? Just I to... have and I forget it. I learned to rock climb. <laughs> and that was something to see. My experience was a little more uh, down to earth, Joan. I taught a TV class in production. Well, actually, there are over 50 programs there from which to choose, and the Disney Institute really has something for everyone. Including Bree and Leary. Thanks, Jonah Regis. Hey, happy Easter, everybody. One of the great things about the Disney Institute is you get to learn to do things you've never done before. So, since it's Easter, I thought I'd check out a couple programs to sort of get me into the holiday spirit. Come on. And I'll show you. How you can make a ribbon. You can put How it on the edge it? of the bed. Hi. That looks great. So this yeah. is the gift from your garden class, not uh, my garden, because I'm from New York. I don't have a garden. And in keeping with this whole Easter theme, we're going to learn how to make the old food basket. Gifts from Your Garden is a program that encourages people to be very creative. Mm -hmm. Here we have several baskets, right. for example, for Easter time. This is a great alternative to chocolate and uh, and sugar. And now this, what exactly are these? These are edible flowers. They have a delicate sweetness. Yeah, it tastes like a plant. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna you're gonna help me make a basket then. Now okay. let's go ahead and begin adding oh. some beautiful cabbage because what Easter basket? is not complete without a head of cabbage. Now that's that's definitely an interesting use of carrots. I've never I've never <laughs> seen carrots so creatively. I displayed. think this is fabulous. Now you guys can help me create the, the perfect ultimate basket, okay? Oh uh, yeah, the purple peeps. That would be good. Okay. Oh, I think that's great. You should see how these um marshmallow treats really set off the bell peppers. I'll give you these because I don't like them. Oh <laughs> how lovely. Here comes Peter oh, Cottontail. Really heavy too. So now I've got my fabulous, ultimate, healthy yet incredibly sweet Easter basket. All I need now is a centerpiece for my special Easter table. Okay, so this is the topiary class here at the Disney Institute. As you know, Disney is known for all the topiaries. They're scattered throughout the park, hundreds of them. This is Laura Core. You're the uh, top topiary person. I want to make my own very special kind of centerpiece. So you, can you help me? Do you want to do one? Yeah, that'd be great. You have your wireframe bunny. Right. And what you're going to do is you're going to take the sphagnum moss. Yeah. Ball it up in your hands as mm -hmm. tight as you can mm -hmm. and start mm -hmm. stuffing with them the frame. Is sphagnum your life, basically? It's a big part of your life, it's isn't it? It's a big it? part of my right. life. Yeah. <laughs> Once my. you get it totally stuffed, yeah. you take the fishing line and you wrap the figure Oops. in her retirement year. She'll be sitting on her porch wrapping rabbits. That's what I do now. Now, what have you been feeding this thing? Oh, my God. Feel the weight of this guy. No more jelly beans for this guy. The reason we use this type of plant material mm -hmm. is yeah. because you can put a few in, and as it grows and you pin it down, it'll eventually cover it and bind over it. Oh, you're trimming the hair yeah. thing. This is good. Here, let me see this for a second. 
is just a little off the top here. You can put eyes or button eyes. Um, you can take fishing line, make little whiskers. It's going to take me a while to do mine, so one great thing about being a co-host is that I think, I don't know, maybe um, this one looks really rather nice on my table. So um, I think I'll be taking this and going. I'll see you later. Hey, thanks, Brian. You passed your course with flying colors. We'll catch up with Brian a little bit later, but in the meantime, don't touch that remote. There's a lot more fun in store. Get set for spring break with the Lawrence Brothers yeah. when the Happy Easter Parade marches on. Hi, we're the Dodgers from Franklin, Indiana. It looks very different. Bent. I'd say unique. But we love it, don't we? It's Johnson's Health Flow. Nursing is best. But Johnson's Health Flow is next best. The nipple doesn't fill with air, so my baby doesn't fill with air. It's designed to make sure I feed her semi-upright, like her doctor recommends. We don't like you lying down, do we? It's from Johnson & Johnson. Yeah. And there's nothing else like it. Johnson's Health Flow. The better way to bottle feed. See that? That's not gas. That's a smile. <laughs> Hey, Snackwell's guy, you lost? <laughs> no, this is Snackwell's double chocolate non-fat yogurt. <laughs> Who's gonna buy chocolate yogurt? <laughs> it's a delicious, rich, creamy snack. I don't know, I think you guys over at Snackwell's have finally lost your cookies. <laughs> Get it? Cookies? <laughs> Snackwell's double chocolate yogurt? Ooh, I'll take the case. So deliriously chocolatey. Snackwell's double chocolate non-fat yogurt. So good, can we ever make enough? Nabisco. The kids have been begging you and asking pretty please, and you really want to say, yeah, we can go to Walt Disney World, but how? Just call for your free vacation planning video and discover all there is to see and do. Even find out how you can stay at a Disney resort for as little as $69 a night. Call now and we'll send you a free video and guidebook offering big savings on a complete vacation package. It's a limited time offer, so pick up the phone now. Call 1-800-814-4545 and make the dream come true. The Walt Disney World Happy Easter Parade will continue in a moment. On ABC Friday, look who's going south of the border on Family Matters to bust Waldo out of jail. Make it snappy. The guy in the neck cell keeps calling me to keep them. <laughs> then it's the duet I everybody's talking about. Firefly. Tony Bennett guest stars on Muppets Tonight. Bet you won't see that on Friends. And will Cody get hitched on Step by Step? We get married. Oh, dude. Then, Coop's back. You never cleared it with the principal? I never cleared it with the principal. It's TGIF ABC Friday. I see a lot of people that put up with scratch lenses. And a scratch lens means they're not seeing properly. And for me, that's a real problem. LensCrafters DuraLens can help make that problem go away. This is steel wool on a typical scratch-resistant lens. And this is a DuraLens. No other plastic lens is more scratch-resistant than a DuraLens. Looks great. Only LensCrafters has them. And even these will be ready in about an hour. DuraLenses help me help people see better. I feel really good about that. LensCrafters, helping people see better, one hour at a time. recognize the faces. The place may not be familiar, but this is the town where a part of you was born. Isn't it time you came back for a visit? Colonial Williamsburg. Call 1-800-HISTORY for a free vacation planner. Paul Berry and Kathleen Matthews, tomorrow on News 7 at 5. Looking at a gull's eye view of the picturesque Disney Yacht and Beach Club Resorts. And we are back at the Walt Disney World Easter Parade. And Happy is right because nothing is going to get in the way of the neat stuff that's coming up, Joan. That's for sure. Let us check up though right now on the Easter Bunny's favorite carrot top. That would be J.D. Roth. Hey, how's it going, Joan and Reach? I'm having a great time down here. You guys having fun too? Good. See, we're on Main Street looking for the best place to watch the parade. What's your name, sir? Don Miller. And where are you from? We're East New Jersey. What do you think of the parade? Great. Awesome. This little guy right here, what's your name? Ryan Miller. Ryan, what have you seen so far at the parade? Horses and little mermaids. Can I have an Easter hug, buddy? Does this guy look cool or what? Let's keep going. Come on down here. 
How are you, everybody? Uh, let's see. What's your name? Hey. And what's your name? Ryan. Ryan, what do you think of the parade so far? Good. Just good? Yeah. I mean, this view's not bad, right? Your front row. Yeah. OK, you know what? I like you guys. I mean, you got nice hats on. Look at that hat. That's beautiful. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these guys for the best seat in the house, better than Regis and better than Jones' seat. What do you think? OK. All right, guys, grab my hand. Grab your parents' hand, your grandparents' hand. We are going to the best seat in the house. Back to you, Joe and Reach. Let's go. Wait a minute, wait a minute. He didn't tell us where he was going. I mean, who knows where he's likely to turn up? I don't know. He's just, like, gone off somewhere with that family. Isn't it like J.D. to always just be <laughs> full of surprises? Now, straight from Grizzly Hall, meet the stars of the Country Bear Jamboree. Big Al, Wendell, Liverless, and Shaker, all fixing to show us some country hospitality boy have they come out of hibernation for some serious easter celebration uh-huh hey you remember this group reed yeah they look like the clockers to me circle and clockers from bartow uh, florida now remember the where the clocker term comes from the heavy, no, wood reed. <laughs> the heavy wood shoes the original clockers wore do i go to the head of the class and absolutely London? now that All you've right. proven to be an expert on the dance Maybe you'd like to take up a little clogging. No, I don't think my downstairs neighbors in New York would appreciate that at all. Then let's just watch and listen. Straight from the old cornfield, it's our scarecrow friends. Standing still is definitely not their style today, though. I love watching these guys, but they seem pretty friendly, actually. They don't really scare me. They don't scare you at all. But have you seen one crow here all morning, huh? All right, you got a point, you got a point. And chicks. They sure know how to move those drumsticks, don't they? Yeah, I'm not touching that line either, Reed. <laughs> <laughs> but looking up there in that barnyard, that's a lady who has worked very hard filling our Easter baskets all year, Clara Fox. I love her. Clara's worked her tail off playing all those eggs. And as of right now, the clock stops here. <laughs> Enjoy your day, Clara. <laughs> Well, after that hoedown, there's no way we're going to slow down. It's time to step lively with the Norwin High School Marching Band from North Huntington, Pennsylvania, under the direction of L.J. Hancock. And they are here to pay a musical salute to a certain famous mouse. Marching band. You know, I can't get over just how great that crowd is out there. Oh, especially the kids. The kids, right? Oh, they're great. Well, I wouldn't be surprised if some of them were enjoying a well deserved spring break. You remember spring break days, oh, are you right? Kidding? Rick? Those days of beach blanket bingo, writing love letters in the sand, Frankie and Annette, meeting the girls in their teeny weeny yellow polka dot bikinis. Yeah, those days. Okay, well, anyway, the Lawrence brothers, stars of TV's Brotherly Love, had their own idea of spring break, and they put on their shades. And they're headed here for some serious Walt Disney World beach happening. Are we invited or not? I think we are, actually. So what are we waiting for? Let's pack our sunblock and go where the boys are. Hey, is this a great way to get around Disney World or what? Hi, happy Easter, everybody. Uh -huh. I'm Joey Lawrence. These are my brothers, Matt and Andy. Hi. And we are checking out what is going on around here for spring break. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to take Typhoon Lagoon. Good, I'm going to take Blizzard Beach. 
Then I'll take river country. All right, you guys ready? Let's go. Let's go. Down here on spring break? Uh-huh. Yep. Where are you guys from? Chicago. What's your favorite thing here to do? Humongo Cowabunga. Have you done all these rides here? Every one of them. Oh, really? So what's the coolest one? I just like the waves. It's the sun. The sun? <laughs> the sun. Interesting. Yeah, have you guys done the rides here? Mm-hmm. Good. So what's uh, your favorite ride? Um, Humongo Cowabunga. Twins, huh? Humongo <laughs> Cowabunga! Doesn't look that bad. All right, I'm here at the top of uh, Humunga Cowabunga, and uh, check out this drop, huh? Here goes nothing, huh? That was great. I think I might have to try that one again, but uh, for now, why don't, uh... Joe, you see if you can top that, huh? Hey, thanks, Matt. Okay, I am here at Blizzard Beach. Now, this place is incredible. It looks like a giant blizzard just swept through this whole area, but you know what? This is Disney, and I'm actually standing in the middle of a giant water park. If you'll come with me, we're gonna go check this place out right now. You having a good time here? A blast! Oh, yeah? Yes! Is the um, spring break crowd here, like, wild and crazy? Yeah, definitely. Wow. Yes, what is your favorite great. ride here? Oh, uh, probably the Slush Gusher. Alright, what is your favorite ride here? Uh, that would have to be the Summit Plummet. Summit Plummet. Summit the Plummet. Alright, I think it's becoming a trend now. Alright, now one of the coolest things here is right behind me. It's called Summit Plummet. It's the tallest, steepest water slide in the world. Matt, you think Humunga Cowabunga was awesome? I'm waiting to see this, pal. Come with me. Alright, this looks really scary. Okay. I gotta get myself mentally prepared for this. Okay, what is my motivation? You're pulling up the line. Yeah. Hold up the line. Yeah. All right. Good. Good works. <laughs> All right, Maddie. This is how the pros do it, buddy, okay? Listen, guys, I want you to count me down from three, okay? All right, ready? All right, go. Three, two, one, go! I don't think so. Woo! Now my brothers think spring break means action and excitement. And my mom says they're a of their opinions. I, on the other hand, prefer a more relaxing approach. Now this is what I call spring break. Hang on, girls. <laughs> Happy Easter, everybody. everybody. Hey, thanks, Joey, Matthew, and Andrew. But can you leave some of the girls for the rest of us guys? Whoa, I see uh, Regis Beach blanket days are far from over. Uh, and this incredible parade right. is far from over, too. <laughs> Just wait and see. Wait a minute, I see beauty, and I see the beast in our immediate future when the fun continues. Hi, I'm Kenny, and that's my dad, Jim. We're the Owen family from Omaha, Nebraska. We're learning rock climbing at the new Disney Institute. Happy Easter, everyone. Yeah, happy Easter. Come on, Dad, let's go. We all work so hard today. That's why I treat myself to Irish cream, amaretto, and Swiss chocolate coffee mate. So many treats, so little time. Flavored coffee mate. Your coffee never had it so good. Really light, with half the fat of butter. Try and punishment, so you're in law school. <laughs> Make every morning unforgettably filly.
When you go on vacation, you want to be close to the action. When you stay in Kissimmee St. Cloud, the magic of Disney World is right at your doorstep. Next door is the excitement of Disney MGM Studios. You'll find new discoveries at Epcot. Just around the corner, you'll see the wonders of SeaWorld. Hold on, you're on an amazing adventure at Universal Studios. Stay in the center of it all at an affordable price. Kissimmee St. Cloud, the best vacation value. For your free close-up guide with discount coupons, call 1-800-711-KISS. Ooh, that was a big burger. A really big burger. Greasy onion rings. Took Pepsi AC, but I still have heartburn. People talk about Pepsi AC. Didn't that come from a prescription? Yeah, I wish it worked faster. Tums works faster than Pepsi AC to help knock out heartburn. Tums just works faster. Mm-hmm. And Tums has calcium. Something my body needs anyway. Pass me the Tums fast. Tum, 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 tum. Now you know why we call it pound cake. New Sara Lee Strawberry Swirl. Lots of real strawberries swirled into moist pound cake. A classic combination. Nobody doesn't like Sara Lee. Viewers like you love Second Noah. Carolyn Moore says... You have my vote. And Phyllis Bruno calls it... Entertaining and uplifting. And June Guile says... It reminds me of the Brady Bunch with animals. Second Noah, ABC Monday. We are gazing at a touch of South Sea splendor at Walt Disney World, Disney's Polynesian Resort. And with that, we say aloha and happy Easter. That kind of puts you in the mood, doesn't it, for a luau? Luau, hula dances, I love all that stuff. You know, the way they talk they with talk their with hands. hands. Yeah. yeah. Cut, stretch, and get <laughs> off the set. I think I've seen that dance you before. <laughs> but wait, wait, I'm getting a JD alert from Brian, and it's coming, I think, from somewhere around the castle. The castle? Yeah. The castle? Look it up there. Look at this, JD. He took that family all the way up in the oh, castle. Gosh. Okay, so as usual, JD has weaseled the best seat in the house, but I'm happy to be here down to earth with all my friends here. How you doing? Yeah. Is this like the best Easter? What's your name, sweetie? Jennifer. Jennifer, where are you from? Florida. Are you having the best time? Yeah. What's your favorite ride? Splash Mountain. Oh, that's so very cool. What's your name, sweet pea? Michael. Michael, and what's your favorite ride? Splash Mountain. Oh, okay, it's a big Splash Mountain. What about the Tower of Terror, you guys? How cool is that? Okay. So, sweetie, what, what, honey? I like the he likes the doo doos going fast. That's right, absolutely. Can I have a kiss, sweet pea? Mm. Oh, thanks. Happy Easter, you guys. Happy Easter, everybody. Yay! Now, here comes a rather unlikely couple Beast and Belle. Ah, uh, but that's true love. Of course, Belle saw the beauty in Beast's heart. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There she is. And straight from the land of enchantment comes a few friends. That's right, Mrs. Potts is out there, the lovable matriarch of the China cabinet. Lumiere has a burning desire to be in the parade. A burning desire, Sorry. yes. <laughs> That's little Cogsworth dancing there. Mm -hmm. Punctuality, of course, is what makes him tick. Check out Chip with that uh, cup runneth over with mischief. And, of course, you can catch all the magic of Belle and Beast and his friends at the Disney MGM Studios Beauty and the Beast stage show. And while some people prefer a spoonful of sugar, we all know that honey is Winnie the Pooh's passion. You know, Pooh loves to celebrate Easter in a big way. So do his good buddies, Tigger, Eeyore, and Christopher Robin. See the little Eeyores out there pulling a wagon, but mm -hmm. I don't know. I think Tigger and Christopher are always pulling a few tricks on food. They always do, don't they? Yeah. And look at all these dancers. Those are all more talented young people from the School of Dance Arts in Sanford, Florida. Well, if you thought you heard whistling, you're right. It's Doc in the happy, bashful, grumpy, and sneezy being escorted down Main Street by their own little Snow White wannabes. Now, I think I only heard you say five. There are actually seven dwarfs. You're right, Joan. You're yeah, right. And the other two. Dopey oh, and one. Sleepy. Yeah, I see Dopey up there. there sure. He's actually escorting Snow White. Isn't he, he sure is. He's no dope. <laughs> uh, there uh, he is, just waking up in time. 
Uh, this has got to be the perfect, perfect place for a parade. And parades are such a big part of Walt Disney World. In fact, the Toy Story Parade, with all of its all-star cast members, still going strong over there at the Disney MGM Studios. And along with the whimsical music of Randy Newman. Let's look and listen to that as we go to break. Hey, Snackwell's guy, you lost? <laughs> no, this is Snackwell's double chocolate non-fat yogurt. <laughs> Who's gonna buy chocolate yogurt? <laughs> it's a delicious, rich, creamy snack. I don't know, I think you guys over at Snackwell's have finally lost your cookies. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> cookies? <laughs> Snackwell's double chocolate yogurt? Ooh, I'll take the case. So deliriously chocolatey. Snackwell's double chocolate non-fat yogurt. So good, can we ever make enough? Nabisco. My family stopped brushing their teeth. They did. My mom says not to brush. She does? Don't just brush. Reach. It's not just a toothbrush. It's the amazing new Reach Plaque Sweeper. Why brush when you can reach? Its densely packed bristle tip reaches where plaque and cavities start. My wife says brushing's out. She does. If a brush can't reach, it can't clean. So reach. Reach is shaped so even back teeth get thoroughly clean. You don't brush. Nope. For healthy teeth and gums, don't just brush. Reach. Woody the tree farmer for Hillshire Farm. Hmm, great tree. You know, it takes great trees to make a great smoked sausage. That's why Hillshire Farm uses my best maples and hickories to slow smoke their sausage for that natural, woodsy, hearty smoke flavor. Hmm, just one bite. You'll appreciate all I do for my trees. They love country. Hillshire Farm, taste the difference. Try our new 97% fat free smoked sausage. When you go on vacation, you want to be close to the action. When you stay in Kissimmee St. Cloud, the magic of Disney World is right at your doorstep. Next door is the excitement of Disney MGM Studios. You'll find new discoveries at Epcot. Just around the corner, you'll see the wonders of SeaWorld. Hold on, you're on an amazing adventure at Universal Studios. Stay in the center of it all at an affordable price. Kissimmee St. Cloud, the best vacation value. For your free close-up guide with discount coupons, call 1-800-711-KISS. ABC Wednesday, Grace gets romantic until Rick's daughter moves in. I worked for your dad. I was just asking for a raise. And she's changing everything. Isn't that pretty, Mama? No, you look like Gabe Kaplan. Grace followed by a special Alan, ABC Wednesday. Sounds of the Caribbean and Dale. Dale. Easter Bunny come to deliver the eggs. Dale. You know, you put a hat on him and a quarter <laughs> in and he just won't quit. But get it ready for a little competition because it's time to strike up the Marist High School Marching Band under the direction of Frank Mana. And they are performing the Stars and Stripes Forever. These kids come to us from Chicago, Illinois, my kind of town. And they are also participants of Disney Magic Music Days. So let's take a listen to the Marist High School Band. High School Marching Band. The band was great, but Reed, 
We've got a lot more exciting things coming our way. Do tell, do tell. Well, I was just told that there's been a fairy godmother sighting. You're kidding me, fairy no. godmother as in bippity boppity boo variety? Absolutely. That can mean only one thing. Where is she? Well, I'm getting excited. Your Where's Cinderella, my Cinderella couldn't be far behind. She is on her way. But before you get ready to get a kiss, uh -huh. which you always do every year, every year, we've got her stitch happy mice, Susie and Perla here. That of course they sewed the dress that Cinderella wore to the ball. There they are. Yeah. And there's the lady that made it all happen, Cinderella's fairy godmother. Yes, with one wave of her magic wand, she makes Cinderella's wishes come true. So you better be nice to her. Happy Easter, everyone. Well, there's no mistake in that radiant coach. Here she is, the reigning queen of the Magic Kingdom, Cinderella. Where's my kiss? Wait a minute. I think she's ignoring you. First time in years. Look at she's this. Right no there. kiss. There's no kiss. This is the first time this happened in years. I can't believe it. Instead of being kissed, I was dissed. Well, here's the reason why, Reed. Why? Look at this. <laughs> it's Cinderella. Oh. Sisters and stepmother, and they want you. They really want you. Oh, uh, yeah, they love me now, but later they'll have me scrubbing their floors. I know that guy. Fix me up with Cinderella, will you? There they are. They love you, oh, Reed. No, no, I don't want them. <laughs> well, I know what you need after that, Reed. <laughs> A trip to Wonderland. And look, do you prefer to have tea with milk or lemon, Reed? Well, I prefer to have my tea with Cinderella. Oh, no, but you just won't give it up. Busy for me now. Get over it, Reed. Get I can't over it. it. I leave it to Wonderland to grow flowers on the Dove the Dancing variety here. Check it out. No shortage of Easter bonnets for this guy. I'm glad to see that the White Rabbit made it, too, and on yes. time, I might add. Hey, who'd be late for all this? Hey, could you guys save me a scone? Get enough of those colorful teapots, though. Well, it's such an enchanting place, Wonderland. It's no wonder the Cheshire Cat is always grinning. <laughs> well, now, do you believe we just went to the Manhattan's uh, tea party? That's the hottest ticket in town, and what could possibly follow that? Well, actually, just about the grandest finale you'll ever see, that's what, and you won't want to miss it because Mickey and Minnie and the rest of the Disney gang are on their way for a show-stopping finale. We'll be right back. at the very top of that you did do before that before it was finished we are back and there's a lot more parade coming our way so let's hop to it hop to it uh, lots of disney characters coming down main street rare fox there hey there's pinocchio hey there's pocahontas uh -huh. there's aladdin and jasmine Hey, there's little bo keep over there and my little sarah oh look at her and woody right alongside of her they're all, of course, again from the movie Toy Story. Hey, they're friends. Hit of the year. And as we look up Main Street, as colorful as a spring bouquet. Yeah, lovely Azalea Trail maids from Mobile, Alabama. And accompanying our charming Southern Bells are a few good men. Mm -hmm. They're handsome Marine escorts. Look Marines. at that shot down at Main yeah, Street. Yeah, the Marines this year. And if they miss a step, down for 10, guys. <laughs> All right, we're rolling on the river with everybody's favorite mouster of ceremonies, Mickey Mouse. And, of course, his significant other, a very 19th century mini, charming with the pantaloons, and storming the pantaloons off everyone on the street right now. All the little children love to see Mickey and Minnie come down that street. They just go wild over them. They love Mickey and Minnie, no doubt about it. Let's go down and check in one more time with J.D. and Brienne. 
Hey guys, thanks a lot. Joan and Reed, you know, I noticed a very large hat on your head. <laughs> well, it's time for a little musical tradition of the Easter break. The oh. annual singing of the uh, Easter bonnet song. Are you guys ready? All right. Okay, I'm game. Yeah. everybody. Bye-bye. See you later. Thanks for joining us. Happy Easter! Bye -bye. The 1996 Walt Disney World Happy Easter Parade has been brought to you by Pepsid AC. You can be heartburn free with Pepsid AC. And Kraft Singles. For great grilled cheese sandwiches, taste the magic Kraft Singles makes. Hotel accommodations provided by the Walt Disney World Resort. There's only one thing better than visiting the Walt Disney World Resort, staying there. From the Disney family to yours, this is Dick Tufel wishing you a very happy Easter.